Without God, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be who I am today. He gave me a God-given talent, and that God-given talent was basketball and my speed and my athleticism. And if it wasn't for him, I wouldn't be who I am today. I'd be somebody else. But I am Jay Sean Augusto, so. <laughs> Man, I can't even remember when I started. It was like four, four or five years old. I remember watching them play, my mom and dad, and there was one time when they asked me to play, and at the time I was like, uh, I don't know, like in my head, I, that's what I was thinking, I was like, I don't know if I can really play, because it, it was adults, but I ended up getting out there, and ever since then, I loved the game of basketball, and from there on out, I just kept grinding, kept trying to be the best. I asked my dad, I was like, can you train me? And my family in New York wanted to see how I was doing and wanted to see my workouts and stuff. So my dad ended up putting me on YouTube. Ever since then, I just blew up and everybody was wondering who's Jay Sean Augusto, who's, who is that kid? And my dad was getting all these different calls from different people, Ellen DeGeneres. Our first guest is an amazing 11-year-old basketball prodigy. Take a look at him. My dream is to be a big star one day. Good Morning America, all the different shows. and. I mean, it was, it was interesting, but fun at the same time. I hated looking at myself on videos. It was more of other people's expectations, like like haters that said, oh, he's not gonna do this, or oh, he's not gonna do that. All of that kind of stuck with me. I wanted to prove them wrong. So expectation-wise, that's what really shaped me to be who I am today because of all the criticism, I'm too small, I'm too this, too that. So that's all just gonna give me more motivation to really try to reach my goal. So when I reach my goal, it's like, now what do you have to say now? Like, I reached the goal that I wanted to get to. What else do you have to say?